Hey, Claude Pliny, Affiliate Starting Line, welcome. This is going to be iMovie Part 3, Editing, and let's just take a quick look on how you start and get into the edit process. So, there's our iMovie template. We created an event in, in Part 2 called Memorial Day. So if I click on it, there it is. And we had imported uh, six clips. Now, in order to do a movie, you have to come up here to create, and you're going to create a movie, i.e. a project. So we're going to create a movie. Um, I'm not going to pick a theme. I'm just going to leave it straight, and I'm going to call this Memorial Day. Let's try to spell that right. Memorial Day Parade, and I'll click OK. So now I've created a project, and you can see that it's rearranged the, 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 the screen, the user interface. Top left here, we have the browser where the clips are. Right hand side, we have the viewing screen. Down here, we have the timeline. How do you edit? Well, you edit by selecting uh, whichever clip you want to start with first. Let's take a look here, what we have here. Now, now, all right, let's take this one. So let's take, let's say I want this clip here, and let's say I, I don't need a whole minute. Let's just take this portion here, and down it comes. So I just clicked it and, and it put it right in the timeline. I have this adjustment here I can make on the right-hand side here, keep this down manageable. So there we have a clip. If I come down here and hit the forward slash key, it will start playing it. All right, now, there are things I can do here to it. I can bring in another clip. Let's take uh, this clip. Let's see what we have here. All right, we'll take these guys. We'll take a 30 second clip of that. I could double click it or just drag it down. There we have it. So now we have two clips. Uh, there are things we can make to, to do to make the, the video a little bit better. One thing we can do, we can add a transition. So here's a fade to black. So I'm gonna put a fade to black at the end. And I'm just dragging here and fade to black at the beginning. So this will dissolve in and out. So let's go back to the top. I hit the forward uh, slash key. And you see how it faded in? And then here you're gonna see it's a straight cut. Now there's lots of things you can do and then it's gonna bring it down at the end here and it'll fade to black. If I want to put uh, an effect in between here, if I want to have some sort of an effect between the, 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 the clips, I can do that. Let's just take uh, a wipe right. I hate these wipes, but this is just for the purpose of the lesson. So now let's take a look. So there we had a wipe right. So here's what we've done. We've taken a, a fade in and a fade out and a wipe right, and we did, did that with the transition. You can add titles if you want. So here we have a title screen, um, and this will put the title of the, par of the thing, the parade in, pixie dust. So if I want pixie dust, let's take pixie dust, drag it down here. Then I'm, what you're gonna do here is you're gonna come up, oh, let me just get back to, the beginning here. There's your title. Now it'll, that's the effect. If you want to see what the effect is going to look like for the title before you put it in, that's the effect. All right, so now we want to put in the title. I'll come up here and type in Memorial. I put my cursor right in the screen there. Day Parade. All right, so. Let's try to go back now to the, you got, I was in this screen here, I'm gonna click down here in the timeline, come back into the timeline. I was, I had clicked up here to the viewing screen so I could highlight and change the, the generic title to the title of the, of this thing. Now I wanna go back and see what happens. Here's our title. So we have a fade in, a title. We have an effect here, a wipe right. And then we have a fade out in the, at the end. So that's how you edit. Um, 
you can play with the transitions, you can play with the titles, you can put in maps and backgrounds, you can add in iTunes, there are sound effects, I would go in here and gra drag down some sound effects. If you're in GarageBand, you can create stuff in GarageBand. Uh, and if you want to get back to your clips, click on the uh, event title and it brings you back to the screen with, uh, that we started out with and then you can add clips, etc. So that's in short how you do a quick uh, primer on editing in iMovie 11. And just for the purpose of showing, I have iMovie 10.0.1 and I'm running on Mavericks, which is not exactly stable. Uh, if you don't have Mavericks, you're probably better off. Um, but if you do, just work with it. And that's it. Hope this has been helpful. This is Claude Plan, Affiliate Starting Line. Stay with it. Stay well. Talk soon.